uh, YouTube. Today we're gonna learn how to make uh, this texture kind of um, smoked uh, with this kind of texture. Um, this is the closest you're gonna get to realistic with Pyro Cluster on Cinema 4D. So let's get started. Um, we're gonna delete everything. It's very simple actually. And um, <coughs> you're going to need a Pyro Cluster pyro cluster for this so go to shader get uh, pyro cluster then go to shader again and get pyro cluster volume tracer uh, go here and go to environment and uh, put the volume tracer in the environment now all you're gonna need is a emitter and rotate it so it's the z axis is pointing upwards actually I'm not even sure if it's called the blue axis, which is, yep, that's the z-axis. Make sure the z-axis is pointing upwards, um, and uh, you're gonna have a have about 100 frames, you know, and uh, let it play. So let's look at the smoke right now. Um, sorry, you can't see the smoke yet. Let's put it on the emitter. And uh, this is what it looks like. And it's taking forever to render. That's because I'm running uh, Camtasia. So um, how do you improve this? This is nothing like real smoke, right? Well, first we want to lock our spot uh, by putting a camera here. You don't need to put a camera, I'm putting it here just to lock the spot. And okay. Let's forget about our camera for now. Alright. So here we have uh, an emitter. Now, in real life, you would have something called shadows. You would have light bouncing around, you would have uh, different colors of lights coming from different directions and stuff. So we are going to have to simulate that. One, you could do it in global uh, illumination and using an HDRI, which still wouldn't give you as much realisticness unless you're using a modified, custom, awesome looking HDRI. Okay, let's keep our light there and we're going to duplicate it three times. Just press control and drag. And uh, first one, let's make it general and make it uh, bluish basically what we kind of want to do is put opposite colors and uh, so you can go with red if you want you can go with slight green but uh, I prefer like orange because it, it warm tone and uh, cool tone right both of them are opposite and you want to put them on the other side and one just white just dim it down a bit and uh, you know, customize the lights a bit. <coughs> you're gonna select all. <coughs> you're gonna select all of the lights and uh, set shadow to shadow map soft. And let's see the white light. Here's the white light. You're gonna put them in the center, but in front of the smoke. Okay. And now you're gonna select all of the lights pull it up right and if you want you can scale it up a bit and you can also rotate it a bit okay and ka chow you have a smoke this now let's look at this still not getting the right effect hmm. do we have shadow map soft on everything Okay, now what we're gonna do, we're gonna double click on our pyro cluster, change the settings to volcano. Good guess. And boom. Now, I'm not saying you should use these exact settings for your stuff. I'm saying take this stuff as your standard baseline and modify it for your needs. 
shadows is exactly what's giving this the look it's getting uh, without shadows this stuff looks weird and not good at all um, and uh, yeah you don't have to use full cane you can use steam if you want I'm not sure if it has shadows turned on but uh, as you can see steam also looks pretty good but uh, smoke let's, let's, let's. and uh, fire fire I don't think it's fire I don't think it's gonna be that good but uh, the point is not to use the presets the point is uh, customizing it for your needs I like using the volcano and just changing the color of it to my needs so like kind of bluish And bluish, okay. And that's gonna really help me out. See, now it's looking like clouds, but uh, it's facing the wrong way. So, you can definitely make some clouds with this. Um, you can do anything you, you want, and uh, that's our tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. This has been HD Video Tuts with a tutorial. Look at the time. That's why I'm talking so low. So, goodbye. Peace out.